Welcome back, baby faces. <laughs> Let's see who's making their way to the ring. Pretty chubby flaco. Dímelo, mi gente. <laughs> JP said. Mr. <laughs> <laughs> Old school. Uh, hey. <laughs> oh, that shit took forever in a day. We back? Fuck what? flex over here. Yo, <laughs> <laughs> fucking flat. We got no ass though. fingers. We got through it. We got through touching it. the soundboard. Welcome back, baby faces. Yours truly is back. Fuck a via satellite. We hey. back with the boys. The full squad is here, mm -hmm. and yo, we got we got summer slam to get you ready for. We Woo! got to get you ready for. Oh, wow. we, got, we got some news for you. We bro. got life to get you ready for. How about All that? Shit. I'm gonna plug up a lot of shit too. But first, let me take it over to old school. He's gonna kick it with some Harley Race. Take it's it just, over. I guess. Uh, we, we unfortunately lost the legend within the business. Uh, Harley Race. Eight time world champion, promoter, trainer. Uh, one of the few guys Andre the Giant was scared of mm. in real life. Uh, the only man to pull a gun on Hulk Hogan. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> in an era it. when people would say shit is fake, no one said that to Harley's face. Mm. Uh, well regarded, well respected, uh, a man that will be missed. True words, true words, man. Rest in peace. Run these ropes, motherfucker! Run these ropes real quick. Ah. <laughs> oh um, my god. Tell me so, <laughs> stay with this. Trevor Murdoch. Uh, was thanking Vince McMahon this earlier this week for um, paying for Harley Race's medical bills. Yeah, man. Awesome, that's, awesome. that's that's pretty cool. That's, that's Yo, it, it, it's a story you know with every um, person we've been fortunate enough to interview, every professional wrestler, and that has been a connection and knows Vince. Many of them talk about yo, he, he's a bit, he he might be crazy, in in certain ways, but he's uh, he's loyal and he, he he's a businessman, but he's a good person. He takes care of his people, no doubt. And that's just another story to add on to the things that he don't say, right? Because yo, Vince McMahon comes out and talks a lot about a lot, but you never hear him talk about that type of shit. The things he does for others, and that goes right. unnoticed. He's and as much as we bash him, you know what I mean? Because he didn't have to do that for for Harley and his family. You know what I mean, um, let's kick, let's change gears, guys. Let's uh, let's get a little excited here, yo. Bueno, that you saw Superman, Chris Jericho, and Matt Riddle going at it. Damn, we're going straight up with the fucking leg drop for this one. <laughs> Pakatang, <laughs> not the leg drop. <laughs> uh, he, gave him, he gave him the Pakatang. But uh. <laughs> Matt Riddle has been healing around on the Twitter sphere lately. <laughs> and, uh, I see what you did there. Ah, yeah. It's so, cause it's like Riddle. <laughs> right? Ain't got nothing to do with his shoes, though, because he don't wear none. So That's that mascot. Zapatilla <laughs> master. That's Lance Storm. That's <laughs> Lance Storm. So he's been talking about the WCW guys and how they're getting af after him, right? Uh, Lance Storm, all he said was, does this guy only wear flip-flops or whatever? Uh, really nothing of any sort of consequence. Uh, Booker T just told him to chill out. Like uh, Chris Jericho just told him to calm the fuck down, like chill out. Um, <laughs> and Matt Riddle is like really upset and I fucking Bro. love it. And I keep doing what the fuck you're doing. <laughs> Except like, I don't know if it's cool if you're like, I'm going to just fuck you up in real life. You know, <laughs> this is my problem, a lot. With these veterans getting salty, I understand as a brotherhood or not, but, you know, professional wrestling was founded on the fact that kayfabe, right, was always on. People, we're, there's stories, legendary stories of fucking wrestlers in the, in the airports acting like they're fucking doing the ring, right? And Matt Riddle's being fucking Matt Riddle, the same person he's in, he's in the public eye, he's just using the vehicle social media. Kayfabe and people are getting dead. fucking salty. And that's why Chris Jericho is a fucking genius. Genius. He hit that response with that little video. That video's popping. Jericho did it better. <laughs> <laughs> that Grinch face. Because you so know that, what? Because so Jericho one. understands, though. See, see Riddle smart. Because he went after WCW guys, but he didn't go after anyone that would fuck him up. Like, yeah. he, didn't, he didn't call it Scott Steiner. Mm. <laughs> right? Like he, he didn't say, pump, baby. He didn't say shit about Finley or about Regal or yeah. or heaven forbid Haku, he'll lose a fucking nose right this there. This is true. Oof. This is true. Oof, you don't want to do that. Uh Pac Buck joins WWE as a producer. What does this mean, guys? Are we uh Best wrestle pro. Yeah, is we gonna, you know, get hooked up in this or uh, see any of the profits of this? No. I don't know. <laughs> he made his debut on Raw. He was one of those agents checking up on uh, Roman. Oh shit. Okay, okay. okay. You know what? it's a it's a it's a big up for him, right? He he was a guy who was signed to OVW. Rise to the top, oh yeah. Uh was released, <laughs> started his own promotion uh, and yeah. uh, and wrestling school. That's dope. Mischief you hurt? 
Mischief, you heard? Oh, hey, that's the intro. That bottle, yo. That's the intro. Oh, but AEW is headed to Boston hey. and to Philly. Hey. 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 Shout out to Rick Shay. Um, yeah, so I think we're going to be out there, right? Let's see. I'm trying to be out there. I don't there. know. Those tickets sell out fast, bro. Day two, uh, day two, well, pre-sale would be announced on Friday as long as uh, from... You, you died on You good? Say, what are you? <laughs> I, I'm, I'm, like, I'm laughing at the potential. <laughs> the potential what? <laughs> Nothing. Oh. oh. It was an inside joke, yo. Oh, inside your mouth. Listen, um, <laughs> hey. October 16th in Philadelphia. You think we can make it? I can make it. Ooh. We're going to be there with the shirts that you can catch now at Pro Wrestling Tees, the Fight Forever shirt, because you know we're probably going to use don't, that. Don't we record on Wednesdays? Oh, Y'all shit. can record. I'll be out Bunch there live, reporting me. live. Awesome. Those checks will be coming in. So, we'll figure that a, out. And that's a big date too. I don't know. Road if we trip. Can do that. Uh, uh, we record in the stay car, tuned, baby. Stay tuned, stay road tuned. trip. Woo! We might record. Record on the road. Yes, on the man. road. We got the equipment, Is that how baby. It goes? Let's do it on the road. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, uh, speaking of AEW, though, they filed the trademark for AEW Revolution. Aye. Is that pay per view? Mm, yeah. Okay. I don't know. I, I'd like it to be. I don't. I don't think their show really needs a title. It could just be All Elite Wrestling. Mm. All Elite Wrestling. And then the pay-per-views have titles. It could right? be a t-shirt deal. Oh, we're part of the AEW revolution. Buy it at ProWrestlingTees.com. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Yo, Sean Spears has been talking to our boy Ziggler. So Ziggler put up a Twitter uh, a Twitter tweet. It was a Twitter Ooh. thing. A Twitter a Twitter pipe thing thing. Ding, 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 dingies. <laughs> Stuffs. <laughs> what the, what S. the fuck? <laughs> and uh, he basically he said best one he will ever have, right? That uh, he's trying to say that this is the best Goldberg's ever going to fucking do. Oh, I would have taken it like Sean Ziggler. Sean Spears. I would have taken it like he would have said, like, oh, like, Ziggler right. was the best Ziggler would ever have. Oh, no. Fighting Goldberg? Think, yeah. Ooh, yeah. maybe. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I didn't yeah, interpret it that good. way. Oh, now I got to read it again. Oh, somebody pull it up. <laughs> Dickie Snacky. Hey. It's Whatever. right here. Oh, my bad, my Look bad. Down. You messed up. How is AEW making that shit more hey. <laughs> <laughs> Um. So, so what does Sean Spears do? No, he just wrote back, this is the best one he'll ever have. Mm. What does that mean, though? Is this the best one Ziggler's ever going to have or the best one Goldberg's ever going to have? Of course he means Ziggler. Of course. I think so. The right? chairman of AEW? Yo, I got a lot to say about that piece of shit, man. Wow. Ziggler yeah, and Goldberg, man. What the like, fuck, What the fuck bro? did Tony Khan ever do to you? Yeah, <laughs> goddamn. <laughs> but first, we'll get there. We'll get there. Uh, the NWA, they're making a TV comeback. No, I heard that at a comp. What? <laughs> <laughs> oh, school. Way on TV, September 30th and October 1st. They you struck get your a, favorite show back. They struck a deal so that they can record in a studio, which is pretty cool because that's like the old school way of doing wait, it. Wait, 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 wait. Now in Atlanta? In Atlanta. Oh, wow. now, now is this going to be center stage? The original home of the NWA during its glory days? Mm, I, don't I know, know it's going to be unscripted, Woo! uncensored, and in your Billy Corgan made that announcement today. Oh, wow. Or two days ago, depending on when you hear this. <laughs> but uh, Friday, whoa. Friday, Friday. How do we feel Friday. about that, guys? It's another wrestling company. Hey. Nick Aldis is out there. They got Nick Aldis, uh, Eli school. Drake, Sienna. Eli Drake. Sienna, Sienna, Sienna. It looks like a they lot got of James, people They got James Storm. Deals. James Storm as well, Cowboys right? Back in yeah, there. some talent, man. Mar- it was Marty's, so the right Marty's been dancing around with them a bit, too. And, and, oh, and yeah. it's been a... Yeah, he has. And it's also they're pushing kind of like similar to AEW where like the you know lo- wins and losses are gonna matter. Oh yeah, you know what I mean, and the, and the fans are really gonna detect, uh, uh, decide on the pace <laughs> of the of, of the entertainment. Dictate. Dictate. Yes. Dictate. Uh, That's. The I, I just word. I just felt like I was gonna say the whole word, <laughs> <laughs> just like dick. You know, so I just left it alone. That was sunny. This I dropped Sean? the thing yeah. like it was hot. <laughs> Cause I see, see the dick coming, you gotta let it go. <laughs> Cause I see sunny days. <laughs> let it go. Sunny days. Some raw, raw, raw. content. Oh, let's for get you a guys. little. Let's get a little raw, raw content. Whoa. Uh, yeah. So, what are we happy about? For Raw. Best match. Uh, happy it was, you know, a Monday. Uh, and Are you happy about Raw? Mondays? Happy, happy. Yeah, Mondays Monday. are the first day of the week. So when I saw the show, I thought... What you saw? I thought it was interesting. I thought it was pretty decent, right? But when I when I reviewed the show, mm. I'm like, yo, the show wasn't all that great. 
Mm-hmm. The show was like lacking in so many ways. Um, well, and, and I think the argument to that is the card, right? I guess it's not it's not many matches to be excited for. Uh, we've seen variations of these matches throughout the card, maybe just two years ago. So, so you're gonna have Trish Stratus so, to show up and not so even like wrestle like. <laughs> And, well, now, and know, after, after how terribly too. she wrestled the evolution, right? Because it was not a good showing of an evolution. It's the go-home. I would have thought she would have wrestled on the go-home. Yo, Trish Stratus, you got to do it. I think you said it best last week, yo. Charlotte could fucking wrestle a mop, but yo, this is going to be a, a bad look. Trish Stratus. That's what I'm saying. might look a little bad on her. I th- I, I'm going for Becky to have a better match. On Sunday, anyway. Yeah, versus Natalia, yeah. Uh, it's just, I'm expecting more out of that. I, I'm, I'm, I'm actually excited for a submit, a submission match, though. And I tell you, it changes it up a little bit. Yeah, yeah definitely. It's definitely a little bit shit. more enticing because, because you, we know one thing, Natty's a technician, right? So at least you know you'll get a show in that way. Storytelling wise, eh? It has that's not great. Song. Yeah, it has that's yeah, yeah, But a, a submission match, but the ring work's gonna be good. You know? Yeah, yeah. Give her a shine. And a she's better been, match than Charlotte versus. She's Trish. been aggressive, yo. That's been interesting. Yeah. That's been good storytelling. You're like that's always Nanny, been. Right? Yeah, yeah. That's always been a better. Even like Trish had to break it up, and she was just like, "What?" So that's why when she was with Beth Phoenix, they made a, a very good tag team. Man, I wish they would have been uh, ch- had a chance at the tag team titles. Because they were ferocious, you know what I mean? Speaking yeah, of the dope. tag team titles. So, well, in a, in a pool full of shit, what's the diamond Banque. gem that you picked out? Super Banque. You think it's the Fatal 4-Way? Um, I like that Iconics lost. Yeah, but like... I, I, they didn't do anything. I don't think it's their fault. No, I think no, they no, did what time. they could. It was, it was time. time. It's, it just was the time. Way, it's the way they lost. It was time. Did they have to be the first ones? Yeah, because yeah. of commercial break. <laughs> <laughs> nah, ass. yeah, cause that ass. They 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 eliminated them. They went to commercial break, and it's like, oh, stay tuned. We're guaranteed to have new champ. Exactly. Come on. Exactly. I was, was pissed. Right? I was pissed wow. watching that shit. It wow. got you excited. Then people would start tweeting. Maybe other See? people start perspectives. Flipping channel. Just whack. Unnecessary though. Like <laughs> my thing is just tell the man. story because you know you have a new champion. You don't want that feud, that rematch, right? Um, and they lost the opportunity. And I mean, at the end of the day, at that point, who was to know? Who the fuck was going to be the champions? Because all I know is Io Shirai came out on the screen. <laughs> <laughs> right? I didn't even know who Yo. was going to. Kabuki Warriors. I wasn't sure who was going to fucking win. Yo, because I tweeted it. Right after it came yeah. out, I tweeted They're the thing. I'm like, birds, Yo, yeah. stuff <laughs> lost. And they were like, Eo. Like, how fucked up is Eo that? Io answered back. She was like, what? What are you talking about? How, how fucked rule. up is that? Like, My bad. That's like <laughs> if they come out with Kenta for fucking <laughs> <laughs> Nakamura on uh, SummerSlam. Been there. Like, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, that's fucked up. Yeah, you had one job, bro. So Good best job. match, Fatal Four Away. What's the best segment? I like. It was Monday. <laughs> <laughs> nah. Samoa Joe interrupting. Samoa Joe and, and the, Ro- the Roman the Reigns beginning? like that. The all of that. It's just, like. it's just unfortunate. It was a weird transition from the Harley Race tribute to. Samoa like, Joe. We did a better job on our show. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't know about that, but I, I, I liked it. I, I liked it actually. I, I thought because I feel like that was real. Like, Joe coming out, like, right after the tribute, Joe wouldn't be disrespectful to Harley Race. He'd let it play, come out immediately after, interrupt the show, and be like, nah. Yo, he was I'm going settled, hard I'm after Michael in. Cole. Yeah. He was going, in, he yo. was going in. I this like is, This is like some more, this is some more Joe's fucking one of the best heels. anti He just doesn't now. get that. He doesn't get that push, man. He looks like me when you I'm think, angry. You think he's, he's anti-hero now? Yeah. I don't, if they keep it he's up. He's always had a following, but he's a vicious heel. I, I, I think when, when he checked on Roman, he became the anti-heel. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. I see that. I can see that. But definitely the best segment of the day. Worst match. And the Samoan shit always ties them together. Worst right? match. What's up uh, with the Viking Raiders with the jobbers, bro? Why do they? Why? Yeah. We're gonna you start. Hurt, we're gonna start right? giving you trophies for yeah, these guys. So, so as soon as you get the worst match, bang bang, because Viking Raiders is stacking up right now with these fucking jobber matches. They they stacking up like it's a fucking Saturday night. Stack them. Like Y'all did the best segment yet? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Y'all stupid as hell. Ain't nobody talking about the fiend. Oh, yeah, the fiend coming out again. <laughs> Talk the fiend. what? The mandible claw. Yo, it was thing. dope, but this is the second, this is the third one already. Nah, what you mean? This is what. Yeah, it's, but if I'm putting it against, if I'm putting torch. it against Roman Reigns, it's the passing of the torch. I'm not saying not to take anything away from it, but comparing those two, I'm, I mean, I'm gonna take Reigns. Ah, uh, I see what you're saying. Only because it's, yo, you got hit by a car. Right? <laughs> I mean, we haven't seen that shit since it's Stone Cold. It's still real to so me. What if Damn it's Stone Cold getting payback for Rikishi hitting what, him or, with the car? What, what if it's Jimmy Uso 
picking up I where did his daddy it for took myself. Over. Yo, but what if it's the Rock? Ooh. Oh, he did it for the Rock. Listen, yo, did listen, I had an interesting <laughs> conversation with with a fan member about this uh, scenario. So SmackDown is going to be in California, October fourth. We would, out, baby. We, we out. They would be there. They wouldn't do that for a SmackDown. It's the first SmackDown on Fox. They would no, do no, that no, for I think, SmackDown. I think it's uh, The Rock <laughs> comes out. Because remember, this week alone, we, he came out saying that he's like quietly retired from wrestling. Yeah, that's right? interesting. I'm surprised time. he doesn't show and his then face to promote that He shows up for the SmackDown. Need don't need that. And who comes out? Roman Reigns. Because they've been, they've been putting them together buddy buddy for the Hobbs movie, right? Hobbs and Shaw movie. Showing all of their family. Oh, yeah, how they helped them out. Right? So that's the kind of storytelling. You want to make Roman Reigns a face? Like, The Rock comes back and does that to Roman Reigns. That'd be a very... And, like, The Rock plays heel. Like, like heel the fuck out. This is my place. And he's like, this is my yard. And this is my business. Like, you know what I mean? Yeah, like, yeah. just It'll fucking... Definitely fuck usher up. in and, yo, a new Tampa, era for SmackDown. WrestleMania in Tampa. Roman Reigns versus The Rock. You can sell me that story. That's a story that's that that's a main event. They should have given us that shit at yo, 35, bro. If that's it ends up being the match. rock, yo, the rock better be wearing like like killer cross outfits with like Ooh. the fucking like short sleeve, uh short short sleeve. Uh, <laughs> short fucking uh sleeve fingered short. off. Yeah, whatever the fuck. Fingered. That is. Like a badass. <laughs> he ain't ricochet. What's hey. the worst shit? What's the worst yeah, shit? Below. <laughs> what was the drizzly shits of raw, guys? Oh, oh man. man. The rest of <laughs> The OBGYN. Yo, what's up? What's Seth, up, man? Seth what's up Brock, with Seth yo. Rollins, bro? Seth yo, and Brock. Yo, shout out to DraftKings having a fucking over under <laughs> on uh for SummerSlam. Really? Legit for free. You can play and well, I got twenty five dollars in my account. They so ask you out. like, what's the first title match? Uh, how many times will the title uh, change hands in uh, the twenty four seven uh champion? Uh, they have a whole interesting bunch of questions, man. Uh, I did a bunch of prop bets. I guess I'm doing that yeah, shit. Yeah, might as well. <laughs> DraftKings sponsor. Bueno. Yeah, I don't want to do that. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so, the drizzling shits with Seth Rollins? So, that's the thing that, like, Raw wasn't, like, there was nothing that was, like, that bad. Horrible. It was just, like. I got to pick something, right? Yeah. So. Yeah. It was like yeah. McDonald's, so, I mean, pretty- right? Like, you get to eat it, and you sort of enjoy it, but then afterwards, you're like, man, that kind of sucked. Well, I got one for you. Dolph Ziggler. And uh, Goldberg, <laughs> that whole that whole charade. You didn't like yo. it? No, I don't like the yo, match. Yo, I don't two like words. Pake. 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 Yo, one word. Pancake. Why? Dude. That happened on Raw or SmackDown? That shit was on Raw. Sure that was on Raw. Raw. So Goldberg came out on Raw. Goldberg came out on Raw. Yeah. Oh. Goldberg would never come next out. Next day we had Miz a, in the ring with Shawn Michaels. Oh. And you know what? In the way, and I will say it started off it pretty good, shit. right? <laughs> By the way, is it gonna look like I don't call a little way too much? Oh my god. Right. But he wishes. Yo, Baby. fucking shout out, happy birthday, to Dolph Ziggler, this past week too. Uh, this motherfucker, yo, the Miz sold it like it wasn't gonna be him; it was gonna be Shawn Michaels. Yeah, yeah, yeah he did. The a way really he good set job. it up, he did a fantastic job. No, and I that's why that you got the pop good. for Goldberg because you heard all week. Oh, that's the rumor. Niggas are like, yeah, right, right. Because who the fuck would have thought this would have been a match? Nah, right. you're right. It who? was done. It was done very well. It was done very well. They they carry. For what yeah. it was, right? For, yeah, it was until they, they announced it. Should have been the Undertaker. Like, why? Why no. is Goldberg? So you, why does I, we Goldberg get it. Come we back? get it. You're why trying does, to. Why does Goldberg come back to because fight he's trying to fix because they need Super Show. He fuck him, right? Like, <laughs> like Vince isn't gonna do anything for him. It's not for him. It's for Vince. Um, Ric Flair is is fucking old, right? Like, and so we need a legend. We need somebody that could come out and like Undertaker is like. He's old and like we do, we've Kurt been Angle's there. Old. Kurt Angle's not a wrestler anymore. Mick Foley's not gonna wrestle like that anymore. We need legends that can stand the test of time, that can like last a couple years, and like can can be like show up at those, do the Royal Rumbles, it's do like whatever, it's like it's SummerSlam, yeah. But isn't that what Brock Lesnar is? Well, nah, because he's like he's not he's still active. As yeah, much he's, as he's active made, yeah. talent. No, yeah. like like Goldberg's got a history, and so. Um, ending on that note, well, with like, more respect, you gotta do it earlier and plan it better and build it better. We we'll build it in a week. No, but Ziggler uh, kicks Shawn Michaels, has a scuffle with the Miz, gets called out by the Miz. All right, now you're gonna fight Goldberg. I'm, I'm yeah. not, I'm not debating that at all. Jesus. That's like no, that was the worst Jesus. decision ever. It's like a six degrees of separation. 
of a fucking match. But <laughs> yeah, it was like, it was weird. Like, but the fact that Goldberg got the got a match is not. Like Vince needed to give Goldberg an opportunity to fucking rectify those sins. Like. Now, so so my, I guess my question, unfortunately, with, a, with another five this, second match, and I say this, it breaks my heart to fucking say this because I am a Dolph Ziggler fan. Oh, he is. He definitely is. Today, then Junior, why the fuck would they give him Dolph Ziggler? Because <laughs> he's, he's a bump machine. Yo, yeah. Dolph Ziggler, so Dolph Ziggler's gonna die. You. Yes. Yeah. Because in order to sell for, I mean, that's all anybody did for Goldberg, right? So in order to sell for Goldberg. Dolph Ziggler's gonna have to fucking go into pulmonary uh, artery, uh, arrest and shit. Dolph Ziggler is a gonna cardiac sell. arrest, and he's gonna have to die. Yo, Dolph Ziggler, and or it, he could go the way of Bret Hart and have a concussion that uh, ends his career. Oh, wow. Wow. I go for give you what a super kick. Fuck? That was uncalled for. He laid the smackdown with that one, gentlemen. Hey, that was a lot. Or he could go like Bret and wear a metal plate around his stomach. And knock out that Goldberg. was dope. Shout wow. out to that. Shout Yo, out to that if place. Ziggler pulled that out, I would die. That'd be <laughs> especially really Toronto, especially since Ziggler Toronto? doesn't wear a shirt. He'll have, he have oh, the we'll get there. We'll get there. We'll get there. Oh, where, 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 where. We'll get there. Let, he peels away his six pack. Yeah, like, yeah. Let's do the A show. The A show. The A show. NXT. Smackdown. So Smackdown A-W? got rewritten. Oh, we got to do this. And then we got we redid it because it got rewritten. <laughs> Let's lay it for smack it down. Holy shit. Yo, so... so, so. <laughs> that shit took mad long I know. Today, right? God damn. Or we just that So happy. SmackDown got rewritten 60 minutes before the shit? No, no. It wasn't 60 minutes, but it was like two hours. So, like, so like why? Vince tore up the whole script and said, we'll do it live. Fuck it, we'll do it live. Like the Bill O'Reilly clip. Fuck it, we're not going live. <laughs> <Yeah>. Fuck, <laughs> Fuck it, we'll do it live. So, so my it. question is, how bad was it in the eyes of Mr. McMahon that he said, nah? You know, right? Because what we've been seeing, it's not excellent. It's not excellent. It's not consistent. So how bad did it have to be? Part part of me feels like maybe it was logical, and he's like, "Fuck that shit," and ripped it up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh my! God. So what was, the be- what was the best match? This makes sense. What was the best match? Vince though? versus oh, the man. script. He <laughs> 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 ripped that shit Wait, up. No. So won. are we saying that Vince McMahon is the heel of the week? Because he tore up a good script. He's the heel of the century. <laughs> I don't know if it was good. I wasn't there. It was mediocre, oh, but God. I can tell you what they did put One out. One of them was definitely had the Andrade thing. winning the world title. <laughs> I know it did. I know if you write <laughs> enough <laughs> versions of the script that has got to be on one of them right like <laughs> out of a hundred chances so, you have to have one the laws of probability law. no, Alistair no. Black defeating Sami Zayn in a good match I liked it that shit was uh, good but why wasn't it uh, uh, why didn't they save Summer it SummerSlam Slam. so yo is he, a, is he a vampire is that what we're doing <laughs> I think he's <laughs> a blade oh uh, no that's Mahershal Ali but anywho <laughs> uh, Smackdown started kind of weak I don't know if it's, if it's just me um, and that's a lot to say considering Trish. how Raw started. Right. Right? Raw started hot. Yeah. I mean, it, was, it started depressing and then hot. So you think SmackDown started with the I worst mean. segment? Um, Charlotte and Trish is Am I the only one that thinks that? I was not. Well, it, it, was, was, it, it was weak. Was it, it Charlotte's physical. fault or was it Trish's fault? I Trish. thought Trish was really like mechanical in her yeah. delivery. Even her slap. Trish is lame. Even She's that slap was just on the like. Mic. Yeah, and then. Bad, so here's the thing. She's always been eye candy then. I'm just saying, <laughs> this is when she's got to be good. This is your opportunity. But she like, backs it up in the ring. But she had a, a terrible We'll see throwing. that on Sunday. Sunday, Sunday. Sunday. Evolution. What's going on on Sunday? The actually, match actually, actually, Sunday. What's going on, bro? We're What's doing a on? lot on What's Sunday. Damas and mucho. We, you know. <laughs> Damas y caballeros. Ladies and gentlemen. Boys and girls. Rockefeller Sports Bar. Mm. 443 Patterson Avenue, East Rutherford, New Jersey. We're going to be there from 6 p.m. on out watching Summer Slam with Woo! you. Come hang with the bad guys. We're going to be chilling, playing Woo! games, Woo! prizes, all sorts of fun shit. Come hang out with us. Maybe we'll buy you a shot. Ooh. Or two. You got a shot at a shot. Hey. So shoot, shoot Just shot. like SummerSlam's <laughs> got a shot at being really, really entertaining. Listen, this card is very, very similar to... So similar. 2017. So if you miss SummerSlam 2017, don't worry. WWE got you covered this year. But there's always potential. And I think that what we didn't have in 2017 was AEW. 
There's a Ooh. certain pressure to put on a really good program, regardless of what the matchup is. And I think that to that end, it will deliver. Hey. So what you're saying, it's a reboot, not a remake. Ooh. Okay, listen. Fire. We can have this conversation once we, we do the take home, but there are some pieces to this puzzle that have revamped their characters, right? They're in a different wave. Kofi's in a different wave, right? Bray Wyatt's in a different wave, right? Trying to see something out of the demon. Whoa, whoa. So, there's potential for this reboot to work. I just don't know. And Look. watch it with us Sunday. Sunday. That's why Sunday. We come Day. Sunday. August 11th, 6 p.m. East Rutherford, New Jersey. We shall be there. Vodka. Psst. Whiskey. All that. Beer. Where's the top? I threw the top at you earlier. But I think I, I, I hit one of the mic arms. Oh, God. Was that a great oh, segment? That was the best segment. So that's Yo, shout out to like, Stone Cold uh, rating uh, chugging of beers. They had him on uh, ESPN, <laughs> I think, and uh, he was rating all the quarterback, the athletes chugging beers. And they showed him at the Raw reunion and uh, chugging a beer. And they were making comments of the fact that he wasted. Oh, you know, people say I waste too much beer, but I'm a performer, goddammit, right? <laughs> and then he rated, uh, you know, Baker Mayfield's chugging the beer. You guys saw that clip? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. When he, he was bit at the, the fucking the beer can, he bit it with his tooth, his canine. Indians? Yeah, he was at the Indians, Indians game. game yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he Shotgun chugged it, it yeah. you know what I mean? Shotgun Still go. Like, That's a hell of a chug right there. That's a hell of a yeah, and then, uh, I really like Baker Mayfield because of that. Yeah, like, he can reinvigorate a city. Yeah, he can. Like, he can. If, if, and if any city needs it most, Cleveland. it's fucking Cleveland. That's why I wanted him to be a Jet, but, like, I no, wasn't no. willing to give anything else. No, I said, out of all the quarterbacks that they won a few championships. That was my favorite quarterback. Cleveland. You know what I mean? If we were running out of that guy in Saquon, if Saquon went first, I would have been very happy with Baker Mayfield. Dog. Just saying. But Shut up with your Giants. Some dog. people, some people don't don't not a fan of Baker. You know what I mean? Well, not a fan. Stone Cold was. Stone Cold was a fan. So what was of the, the best shit of SmackDown? It's best segment. Roman Reigns bullying Buddy Murphy. <laughs> Yo, I like yes. I like how you beat him up. Actually, yeah, yes. I like that Buddy Murphy wasn't actually on like the screen. Someone you know? ate his lunch. That that felt like real. Like that felt hard. Like Doyle Murphy. rules. <laughs> Yo, was it was it me or or did I hear him say Braun Strowman? Braun Strowman. Well, he was no, asking. He said, him. he said Rowan. Nah, he said Rowan. He said Rowan. He said Rowan. I I heard Braun Strowman, and then when he repeated it, I was like, oh. no. Apparently, there was there was online reports that Braun Strowman admitted. That he was behind those incidents. Oh, that's I, what you probably heard. I thought, but no, I thought I heard Buddy say Braun, Braun Strowman. I'll tell you what, I'll let. See, like this is a perfect storyline that has nothing to do with a title, right? Yeah. Let Braun chase Rowan for a while, and then when Rowan gets beat up and whatever, it's not Rowan. Who the fuck was it? It was oh, Braun. It was Braun. It was fucking oh, Goldberg. Yeah. It was fucking. It like, was who? the Rock. <laughs> it was the Rock. It was the motherfucking rock. I did it for the rock. The drizzly <laughs> shit. I did it for the people. <laughs> the the drizzly shit. Daniel Bryan, and he pulls the higher power where it's, it was me. Well, that's what they're insinuating <laughs> right now. It was me. I just don't see the angle, right? You know what really sucked? Mm. Ziggler uh, and uh, Mustafa, Mustafa Ali. Ali. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Which is terrible considering the two talents in that ring. I'm like, you hey, let's sucked? have like an IC run, but you're going to lose before we let you have an IC run. Well, he, he jumped to Rey Mysterio. And he took two L's, right? Because he lost last week, too. Mm-hmm. I just feel like they're, they're trying too hard to cover up these pre-match rituals that'll take you into commercial break mm. and then resume with the match. Well, they're still trying to iron those details out, right? It, 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 it's, a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a philosophy shift, right? How'd you feel about that Kevin Owens segment with Shane McMahon? <clears throat> uh, it was pretty funny. I thought it was all right. Like it was, no, I, I think it's worth mentioning at least. I'm like, not mad at the Shane angle. Uh, it's not. It's not it well. works because yo, it's Shane. Good. Shane is in the best shape of his life I'm for the last couple of years. Let him wrestle. He, he, yo, Shane has been is in better shape the later part of his career than he was in the beginning. Yeah. He was doing all the crazy stuff. He was just a spot monkey yeah. in the beginning. Yeah. He was just jumping he, on. He, the he can now go to the ring. Yo, yeah. he's, yeah. Had, he's had good mania matches. Yo, yo, I will always give him credit for that AJ Styles match. Yeah, I th- match. I was so impressed. I was like, yo, he got in there. Like he got in there. No, 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 yo, I'm not mad at Shane. Honestly, we do a best of of his stuff. Maybe we should. Uh. It should, and I will say it's been Shane more recent. Appreciation Night. Okay, coming from Hills Pops and Chair Shots, Ooh. you guys are gonna hate love this. I promise oh, you. Absolutely, absolutely, best in the world. I'm not doing that shit. Yeah, you <laughs> are. Don't be a bitch. All right, what else we got? I think it's time for some heels, some pops, and some oh, chair shots. Yes. 
Oh. oh. That's not it. That's not it. <laughs> that was not it. <laughs> <laughs> the ambiance just changes and it gets darker. I said it. It looked all the same. <laughs> <laughs> so, so heels, pops, and chair shots. Who was healing this week? Heal life. Hashtag heal life. Who was the evilest villain of them all this week, guys? Vince McMahon. <laughs> Ziggler. Ziggler was trolling this week. Ziggler. Ziggler was trolling. Vince McMahon for tearing that SmackDown. That <laughs> very good SmackDown script. He's I like, know if, I don't know if it was very good. Sense. What if Vince <laughs> is right and the scripts fucking suck? Like, wh- like I don't know. I, I, I don't know. I wasn't that's, there. That's what I'm saying. How bad did it have to be? <laughs> then more right? than once. Twice. Like, how <laughs> bad did it have to be to him say no, no to all of them? <laughs> but who hired those people? No, and then no to but himself. But who hired those people that he made that no, shitty script? He said no, and then no to that's himself. What, what if it was like Vince. a Vince Russo-style script, and he's like, fuck this. Uh, I just he read, saved us. I just read an article from one of the, the wrestle sheets or whatever, um, and it was like all the comments about Vince McMahon and like ver- working with Vince McMahon or whatever. And yo, they, it's all like that. Like it's exhausting. It's twenty four seven, and you're just playing. Guess what Vince wants? Yo, it's all about the fifty fifty booking, bro. It's a fucking. And that shit is it's ass. Wild that like everybody's like, no, this is trash. But pretty chubby Flacco. Let me what hit do it. you <laughs> think was the heel of the week? Ziggler. Ziggler Why? was trolling us. Acting like Goldberg on SmackDown. Yo, when he came out to Goldberg, Yo, did music? he even headbutt the door? Yeah. No, well, really. he hit the door. I don't well, know remember, ever. just the Super week prior, kick. he came out like Shawn Michaels. Word. Yeah. Right? The music popped. Everybody thought, you know, so it, it makes sense. It was pretty good. He did better than Gilbert. <laughs> <laughs> Facts. Don't uh, sleep on Gilbert. Would you say Rowan <laughs> might have been healed of the week? I think he's the evilest motherfucker of the week, yo. Nah. Random motherfucker I think over. I, I think, think it was Buddy Murphy. I think Rowan is innocent <laughs> until proven it. guilty. Yeah. Matt that's Riddle. A good, that's a good Matt one. Riddle. Matt Riddle. Why? Ooh. Oh. <laughs> he, he was going after everybody. He was the real Rowan this week. Yeah. Ooh, the heel of the week. Listen, when Matt you when Riddle. when you have the In legends tweeting, they get tight. <laughs> <laughs> Better get tight somewhere else. They don't know so, Twitter yo, like this everybody man else. This said he'll knows. fuck up Chris Jericho. Yo, he bro. said I will fuck him up. And Chris Jericho just went. That's awesome. Like, that is great. That's the, exactly but, but the, the, the point of view that Chris Jericho should have. But but, but you know what? It, it, it's what's so different from the angle that Brock plays, right? Because that's exactly what Matt Riddle's saying. I was a fucking MMA fighter. I can legitimately fuck you up. It's crossing that line between reality and, mm. and professional wrestling. See, that's the problem is that, like, you also you can't sell yourself like that either. You have to be beatable by non-kayfabe. Like, you know what I mean? Like... If you exactly. Yeah, you've got to be mortal. Like there's got to even be on social media. But here, here's I, the you thing can't though. just be like, I, you know, I can fuck you up in real life though. Like that's he didn't say that though. He, here's he the didn't thing it's though. Just the way he Riddle, carries, though. Riddle is not Brock. Brock can genuinely like ninety percent of the population. Kill Brock will, smash. Exactly. Matt. So came in last. Bro, week. hit him hey. with a spleen. He's over. I, <laughs> I'm just saying there are probably a couple of good you know bar brawlers that could probably take him out. Okay. What was the pop I, I of the mean, week, yo? What made noise besides gold? Braze attack on Kurt Angle? Oh, that was fun. We almost didn't cover that. <laughs> but that was a good time. He's a heel too, I guess. How right? about how about <laughs> the Street Profits offering them milk? Oh. <laughs> yo. yo. That was a pop. Yo, yo I'm looking forward to their, their influence on SummerSlam. I'll tell you that much. They're hosting? They're not hosting, but I'm sure they're going to be incorporated they're somewhere. Some they put on every fucking they, Raw. They put the hoe in hosting. And SmackDown. <laughs> You know I, mean? I like them, yo. At, I, at first, works. I was like, ah, this is kind of corny. And now I'm kind of like digging it a little yeah. bit. Montez Ford. He's the, he's the charisma. Superstar, yeah. bro. Yeah. He is the catalyst. Angelo, like Angelo, yo, you got to tighten up a little bit. Sometimes you're, you're, you're slacking a little bit. He's the heater. Bro. Right? Bro. That's what he's there for. He's supposed to be Montez, there to though. back it up. Yo, Montez. Montez holding yeah, down. Yeah, with, sure. That's why he got the bedazzle cup. Right. This Although I will I will say he was beatboxing like a motherfucker the other day. Yeah. It was good. It was good. Yeah, yeah. Uh, chair sh- Oh no, wait. What else? What other pop? Pop, 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 pop. New woman's tag champs. <laughs> Listen, Nikki. Uh, that's my chair pop? shot. That's my first. Damn, one man's pop is another man's chair shot. Oh. Oh. You think that was whack? Why was you that whack? A just, magnificent I'm, ass. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The asses aren't Alexa. Up, 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 like. oh, anyway, <laughs> listen. Nikki. Alexa, twerk. Nikki Cross has lost herself, and she does not belong in that tag team. Doesn't belong together, I don't think, though. Diminishes her character. Her fighting moves don't even make sense anymore to me. 
No, I'm not here. The for only it. way this makes sense if they break up and that turns Nikki crazy. Right. But I do want, they need the titles I want for that? Nikki to be the one to turn on Alexa. Yeah, be like a heel, be dirty. So, be so, like, so, right, so is it, is it I you want, want Rosemary the, out of Nikki. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Is it you want the angle like they're still tag team champions, but they're going to get at each other all the time? Nah, they could lose the titles. Yeah. Okay. So then why the fuck give them the titles? <laughs> right, that's what I'm saying. Pa que? <laughs> like, like, it's going to last for Like, it weeks? just doesn't make sense. For, forcing them to have a reason to be together. Bro, because Alexa's over. But they're already together. I popped. Like, they're already together. They've established that for months. Yo, Vince loves Alexa. A year ago, she was the woman's champ on Raw. I love Alexa too, and we love Nikki too. We're just debating the fact how they're using them. I don't love this. You know what I mean? I love NXT. I just don't love the way they were using them. They're both talented wrestlers, yo. Like, if it ain't broke, don't fucking fix it, right? Nikki was fine. So the reason why you put her on the main card to begin with, because she was fucking a maniac. She was the psychopath, the women's version of Dean Ambrose, right? That was the angle she was. Facts. And and you now you don't have Dean Ambrose. Why the fuck would you? Now they don't have Nikki either. You're already limping. Why are you shoot yourself in the foot? I really liked yeah, the big. Iconics reaction to losing <laughs> the titles. <laughs> I love that they wild out. You saw the meme that came out? Billy yeah, Kay. Billy K. Me swinging. when my parents denied me a, a sleepover. Eighth grade me. <laughs> yo, uh, they're hilarious. And they need to be showcased more. But I would love for them to like get the titles back in like four ways and like crazy matches like that. And then lose the titles in one-on-ones. And then like keep doing that as heels. You know what they're missing? Like, they're missing a tag team to counteract them. I, I the look revival at, like of females. You know what I mean? Like to a, a certain extent, right? To a degree, because I see them the as Edge and Christian. Man. They have Edge and Christian p- p- yeah. potential as, as the a duo, them, right? Yeah. So, so, so no Hardys right now. They don't have Hardys. They don't even have a Bubba and Devon. Could, could you say that maybe the Kabuki Warriors? That's could what be I was going to say. Yeah. Then fucking book them the right way. They're the only tag team that makes could, sense. It, it, it could work. They, but see, the, the, even the way they try to introduce that with Paige has not worked. That's the problem. Maybe if they called up Io Shirai, they would work better. Apparently, that's what. <laughs> so that's what we're trying to do bro. <laughs> that's what WWE thought all oh, along. Oh, how, about, how about some mic work, yo? How about Trish Stratus's mic work? Oh, oh, girl. Chair shot. You sounded rusty. <laughs> that was. Chair shot. <laughs> Is that like a Did frog? Did I request now? Are we, we can request them? Chair shot. Chair shot. Yo, uh, I'm thinking Adam Cole here. Would you be a good chance? Paranga got to be yeah, but <laughs> would you say that uh, Brock Lesnar beating the ever living shit out of Seth Rollins yeah, was the man. chair shot of the so, week? So, 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 yeah. it's crazy for me to say that. What the fuck is Seth Rollins doing? When he got up, chair yo, shot, yo, <laughs> yo, turned down yo, for what? <laughs> he he actually got up from that and was like. Uh, I'll be there at SummerSlam you and not. I'm gonna win <laughs> yo yo hold on but yo. like there's storytelling like, like there's a little bitch they've gotta there's, there's something's gotta come of this yeah you know what it is though I think he sold and so much him. that it's not believable he can win like he yo he got that's what I'm saying how, how can they sell me that you're gonna you, you're gonna lose to fucking that Seth you Rollins know what I'm like, listen he's got to show good, fire you want to do good storytelling let him lose this let him lose this opportunity let him like start looking raggedy let him like start like losing himself and then like have Losing to like smile yeah lose your smile and like have to come back from like the dirt where like he's like losing to jobbers and shit mm. and like really have to like build him up from scratch where he's like I don't know. Maybe he gets a Mr. Miyagi. Maybe he gets but, a. Uh, but did he need that? You have a twenty four seven following that's good you around. Story I think, I think we need. I think we need heel Rollins, bro. I think we need the highlight back. Ooh. Yeah. Bring back, the, bring back the highlight. No, the arrogance. He, he, has he been demasculated because of the man? Yeah. 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 Like is that what it's it is? It's tough. I mean, they they, they yeah. neutered him, bro. <laughs> right. He's been they neutered. Yo, man up. How about that twenty four seven title, guys? Are we tired yet? That shit was um, a chair shot. It, I I appreciate. That shit was a chair shot. I appreciate the storytelling, like trying to tell that OBGYN story. I was like, just concerned, man. That old OBGYN office was very sus. <laughs> Why are there curtain walls? Like, I don't think it was up to code. <laughs> I don't think uh, she should have went in there for a check. That shit looks like it was shot in fucking Burgerland, bro. G- guys, I thought of one more <coughs> possible chair shot. What's that? Oh. Twitter with the fucking cover to WWE 
uh, 22k. Oh, you don't like it? Yo, the internet's going wild. What's up oh, with that? What, like social media covering All, all about the fuck, yeah. The, bitching and moaning because fucking Roman Reigns and Becky Lynch are on the cover? Oh, yeah, they, the you know you got the hate. Who else? Who else? Oh, they want it, Seth. But why Doink the clown. But why not just Becky? Why Roman? Uh, why the fuck s- Becky? Because it's Roman. Because it's Roman. Because he beat cancer? <laughs> Yeah, or, or, or is it, it that they the don't top. trust that That's Becky alone with Safari? They had a hard time deciding who's getting the SP for that shit. Yo, they had they both had really like strong years. Like you can't, I I I, I see what you're I see where you're going, but like they both had really good years in WWE, like merchandise wise, like storyline wise. They had championships. They fucking like Overcame they they cancer. they headlined fucking WrestleMania. Like, dude, Roman Reigns and Becky Lynch were two really really good choices. You can argue like either one singularly, but I'll tell you why this the much. fuck not? Like I like the trailer yeah, because the, 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 it doesn't matter what anybody you know why? thinks. The face of the company is Roman Reigns. The trailer was really good, and now Becky on the women's side is the face, right? But the face of the company has been Roman Reigns for a while, which is yeah. why we were all hating on Roman Reigns just a few years back. That's never gonna change because it was force fed. You know what I mean? Uh, change. And that is the best thing about. 2K motherfucking 20. 2K20 looks like hot garbage. <laughs> the graphics have not upgraded in like four fucking Since years. 03. Dog. Like, <laughs> come on. Yo, do something different. There's no GM mode. And like, you know what you like, can do? Come on Sunday to Rock and Fuller Sports Barn Grill. We will have WWE I'm 2K20 to do too. <laughs> available for play. <laughs> oh, I didn't know that. We yeah. got 2K20 available to play. Yo, you better follow through on that. Thank you, WWE, for yeah, supplying I think he meant 2019 because 2K20 don't come out to like... Uh, we got an early <laughs> release. I feel like we're overselling right now. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. I think we're overshooting. I don't know. Come <laughs> oh, yeah. get, get, get the sauce. Uh, we out here. Supplies are limited. <laughs> we definitely have We definitely Car- have prizes. Card subject to change. We do have we prizes. We have prizes. Though. We have some dope prizes. Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Come get the sauce for sure. Aye. So, let's get them ready, guys, because this Saturday going to be a thing. Oh, that's a thing thing on Saturday? What's the thing thing? It's going to be the newest pay-per-view. The newest pay-per-view? For the NXT. Oh. Since uh, Mania Weekend. Since Mania Weekend, right? No, since, um... Yeah, since Mania Weekend. Damn. No, you know what? I'm since really Bridgeport, impressed. Or, right? Bridgeport? I'm really Connecticut. They had a Connecticut show. Yes, yeah. yeah, Connecticut, the twenty fifth. Twenty fifth. Yeah. Yes, you're right. All right, all right. Yeah, whatever. Takeover. Let's go. Fuck Saturday, 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 Saturday. I'm really, really impressed with the opening match, right? Uh, uh. Candice LeRae versus Io Shirai because Io Shirai mm, had to pull double duty attack. apparently. The e- <laughs> 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 uh, according to whoever works at WWE, tri- uh, the trucks. In production, Mother Yo, they had her on I can't and wait and till and she's and also in the NXT women's match. Yo, Shirai, the women's oh championship my God. match. <laughs> Listen, I, I want Yo Shirai to do work on Candice Yo, LeRae. There, there, there is, a, is there's a gimmick change, right? She's darker now. Mm-hmm. Uh, she kind of looked like uh, Underwood a little bit. Uh, fuck, what's the name? Tanisa? I'm fucking up the name bad. Oh, Tanel Dashwood. Tanel Dashwood. Emma. Emma. Yeah. What did you say? I said a lot. <laughs> <laughs> he went for I, Carrie I, Underwood. I, I, think think <laughs> I heard Tony Braxton. <laughs> I was going to go with Carrie Underwood. So I, I heard, heard Lucy Liu. Hey. You didn't hear Whitney Houston? Who we got, yo? Who we Nobody got? Did. Say booty, yo. I got Iru. I got Iru Shirai. I don't know, yo. I don't know. Yo, Shirai better win, and it should be a squash, yo. Is, can, is, nah. is, both, is both Johnny Gargano yeah. and Candice Lurie going to lose? Is that household going to take a double L? Maybe. Yeah. Hmm? Maybe. Yeah. Yo, you're an actor in the story, right? Tell a story. I think Io Shirai is the more important story to tell, right? Like, Candice LeRae's got to take this out. Like, maybe they can have a good match. Maybe not. But I think Io Shirai's got to look strong, right? Because okay. you're building her up, right? Because Shayna Baszler's not going to be there forever, and you need someone for Bianca de Belair to bounce off of. Like, true? you can't just leave gaps in... <laughs> in your fucking uh, Marvel comic universe in NXT, right? So <laughs> you got to have uh, uh, balls in the air, and I think Io Shirai's got to be strong. Air. That's not to say that, like, Candice LeRae should be what? buried, per se, but I think just the Io Shirai storyline is more important. Here's the thing. Candice can be rocky, right? She can take that ass beating and come out looking like a champ, <laughs> right? That's what and Johnny Gargano does, does. And she does it better than most will ever do, hey. male or female. So? Ooh, wow. so, so I, 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 I
I'm leaving. So, so <laughs> <laughs> okay, Molly Cream. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Creamiest of the top. NXT what? Tag Team Championships. What? Street what? Profits. Undisputed Era. Who's winning? Uh, I like the Street Profits return. Uh, yeah, man. Uh, and, and the thing is, if they lose, is it because they're getting pushed up? Nah, I don't know yet. I hope not. I think Cole needs them still. We yeah. need... I, especially after, I'm sorry. We... I think... I think... This is a night that it starts with the Undisputed Era winning the gold, bro. Yeah. I think this is the first. This is where it begins. Well, they they win and come up? They hold all the I gold. Think, I think they're leaving NXT oh, so with hold, all the oh, gold. Oh, yeah. no, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because okay. if you think about it, the Street Profits are, are making their way to Raw. I mean, it lo- does look so, right? They're, they're already there. Using, they're like, there. they were on stage. They're over. Yeah, they are. Monday night. They were. Yeah. They were on they're, stage, bro. They're over. And I think... Uh, NXT needs the undisputed, the undisputed era for their as Fox a, show. As a touring company, you need to have quality talent, right? And having undisputed era there keeps the uh, the tickets going. Yeah. Well, because the it the, draws an audience. The yeah. rumors are right. AEW. I mean, AEW is going to be on TNT yes, on Wednesdays. AEW Revolution, mm. perhaps. Right. Um. So, it, it, but NXT is going to be on FS1. And so if NXT is going to be on FS1, they need to come with, like, a Love show. Theaters. Yeah, they've got to come with a show. So yeah, It's all like Street Profits. I don't know. But even if Street, if Street Profits retain, like, I do like champions of NXT showing up at on the main brand. If you're a champion of the lower brand, mm-hmm. right, mm-hmm. that's why uh, Chris Jericho called Matt Riddle a uh, minor, minor league player. Yep. Which means that I was right all the fucking time. That's why I'm the champ, right? I don't know what you mean. But, like, the champs at that level should, I wouldn't say job, but they should have those kinds of, like, street profit vibes. You know what I'm saying? Like, those roles in the back where, like, even, like, the the top. Think about this. Adam Cole, as champion of NXT, right, comes with Undisputed Era, right, to Raw, and they think they're hot shit, and somebody's, like, Calm the fuck down. The Usos are like, hold on, cuz. Yeah, yeah. Yo, Us, look at these guys. They come up here. They think they know everything. Blah, 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 mm-hmm. blah. How about mm-hmm. you calm the fuck down? And like, sun them. They, they get sun. So Undisputed Era now has a storyline built in, and they don't have to execute it any time. Yeah, they you know what back, whenever like months later. Months later, they're like, yo, yeah. you remember that one time back in February and when it was cold? That's why I thought another Usos person had the who. the world, uh, world tag team titles. The day after WrestleMania, all of a sudden, bam, Red bam. Dragon jumps them. Bam, bam, yeah. bam. Like, yo, they just ready to go. And so that's why I also thought the people behind the, the car accident for Roman, probably undisputed error. You think Oof. so? Mm. It's supposed to be a long what story, if, right? What if Ziggler beats Goldberg because of undisputed error helping Ziggler? <laughs> all four of them come in. And attack Goldberg. That Zig- is so. That is so amazing. Ziggler it will never happen. As the head, <laughs> the head of Undisputed uh, Era. I'll take it as their way in. I really like that. I'll take Build it as their way Ziggler in. as like, hey, oh, I'm the main card guy. They all come up, and then him and Adam Cole never get along. Because they they're always like alpha, right? Like uh, they're always like fighting. They turn on Ziggler. Alpha and Omega. They turn on Ziggler. They just use him as, as a way to get in. Woo! Yo, pay us money. Mm. Give. Me, you see, money. folks. You see, book folks. Us to book you. It's Come not on. that hard <laughs> to make something compelling, fam. Oh my God. Se me paró. Speaking NXT, of compelling, North American Championship Velveteen Dream, who came out in the commercial, by the yes, way, for two K twenty. Crash ass game. First time Velveteen they Dream highlight NXT like that. I feel Roderick Strong, yeah. right? Pete Dunne. Mm. That's the future, bro. I, did you see the Pete Dunne and Roderick Strong match last yes. week? Yes. Yo. Yes. That was amazing. Can I just say, I honestly, yo, 100%, yo, no bullshit. I do not give a damn who wins this match. Nah. I nah. don't care. This will be it's a This like match crazy. is going to be match of the Fine. weekend. Weekend? Right here. Okay. Right yeah, here. I see, I see that. Match I'll of the weekend that. right here. Yo, We've you. already seen other matches on this card. Yeah. Yeah. This match is going to be... This is the one they give you for the weekend. Yeah. So who you got? I got Velveteen Dream retaining. Yeah? Damn, but I, I would love Pete Dunne to pick up another strap. I feel I feel like it might be Pete Dunne's time. 
Yeah. Storyline wise, I think me and Pretty Chubby Flock are going the same way. Roger Strong. Roddy takes it, and then maybe Pete chases him. Okay. I think. Well, I think right, it's. I think it's Roddy's time, bro. With all the so dogs. so so re- realize also, whoever does not win this title, that means that individual potentially will be jumping up to the main title. No. Right. Well, well I that, think Velveteen that's, doesn't. That's retain. what I think. Velveteen's time Velveteen's to chasing. go up. Nah. Uh, I, I, I would I say think Velveteen so. to move you, up you, too. Nah. No, 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 no. With think, a heel heavyweight champion, no. you need to face Chaser, right? Uh, Velveteen no. goes that line. He yeah. can he be a face. face. He yeah. can be a face. Yeah. face. Yeah. Especially against Adam Cole. It's working. Yeah. Yo, more. Velveteen Dream does such a great job. He can do whatever the fuck yeah. he wants. Exactly. It doesn't matter. He knows. He learns. He learns storytelling. Yeah. So he got it. Uh, with that being said, Shayna Baszler versus. My yin. Shayna Baszler. Come on. Mm-hmm. Too easy. Bask yeah. in her glory. Yeah. Yeah. Everybody? I mean, uh, probably I wouldn't mind seeing me. I'm, 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 over, seeing Mia I'm, I'm over it. I'm over Shayna, bro. You over Shayna? I feel like she should debut on SmackDown. Once again, if, if Shayna loses, is it potentially time for call up? Yeah. But we're at this portion of the year where this type of thing doesn't happen. Um, you know, Ronda Rousey is now being like buzzing right like this shit is uh oh, what people are talking are about you, yeah yeah do you miss her so maybe you hold off a little bit on this ronda rousey talk you give Shayna baszler uh, n- uh like you let this title reign last a little longer you have the other two girls start coming up and you let the four horsemen debut on smackdown Yo, yeah, that's something they wanted for Survivor Series last year. They didn't get, and that'd be and great, maybe, but it depends. Survivor Series is in November, Papa. I remember that. Yeah. Yeah. And maybe they're not too far off at so, this point. So Sasha Banks has to come back. I was gonna say, wait, two. is Sasha coming back though? Yeah, are yeah. we between now and then? Yeah, are, okay, I expect but Sasha be, at the pay per view on this week. But before Survivor Series, are we having a all women's pay per view? No, nope. nah, no, it doesn't so seem that way. They have not. Oh, that wasn't gonna be an annual thing, huh? No Queen of the Ring. Oh, that shit that's trash. Dope, I would have liked it, yo. That would have been that dope. Young dope. Classic. The Mae Young third? Classic was dope. so good. Yeah. There's not even a Mae Young Classic? No. no I, haven't heard of I bet you there won't be a, a Mae Young Classic because of all the talent being signed to AEW. Mm-hmm. This is pro- look at they'll look be, at the, still look at the fine ta- talent. Look at the bro. talent on Impact. I mean, there's there's, there's still yo, talent. There is always that risk. The Impact Knockout Division. Probably Yo, the best son. If if it was, if, I wish it was deeper. Like I wish they would. They had more girls, but yo, they're so solid. Good. Here's the thing: there. the Impact Knockout Division since day one has led this revolution. Mm. 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 With Gail Kim, Gail Kim, Gail Kim, Awesome Kong, Mickey James. She's awesome. They were doing something different the than the E was. People. Yeah, Lakel was just a really bad knockoff. Beautiful people. This is true. That's all well and good, and and you're you're right on so many levels, but right now, but right now, Tessa Blanchard, Jordan Grace, the things they're doing with the men, Sue Young, the Sue Young, that that Rosemary, uh, fucking Valkyrie, like yo, they are top notch, and I'm forgetting people, like they're so good, Kara Hogan, Kara Hogan Kara is Hogan. so good, yo, like it, it's so fucking top notch. Are they better? Than the WWE women's division, I right think now? they utilize better. They, yeah, definitely. They're being they have a different matches. Yeah, it's a they war, had that it's a good ball match. They it's can, a good they balance. Can go it's a, they, they can go, go different. It's a they can go different. It's a good it's a good balance as far as how they push the, each of those individuals compared to the women, right? I mean, they tried with Lacey Evans, but then what has happened since then? I don't right. think any female talent surpasses Charlotte right now. That's my nah, opinion. Nah, no That's way. my opinion. No way. Yo. She's the face of the women. I think. In the in the wrestling yeah. industry? No, in WWE. No, 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 no. Uh, yeah. Per per Vince. The yeah. NXT championship. Two out of three falls match. Each fall has a different stipulation. The first fall is a regular match. The second fall is a street fight. And the third fall is yet to be determined. So ladies Ladder. and gentlemen, Adam Cole, the champion, versus Johnny Gargano, who you got winning it all. Or <laughs> Adam Cole. You just like the fucking drop. What drop? <laughs> <laughs> that, that happens all the time. Uh, I'm here. saying, though. No, what do you mean? Uh, it's just... If, if 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 some of our theories are correct... All of them are. <laughs> the Undisputed they're Era... All, even, even the ones that debate each other are all correct. <laughs> they're all correct. <laughs> the Undisputed Era will leave this pay-per-view as champions. And they will also not... Cause we're they're all correct. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Imagine. I'm imagining. Roderick Strong, Bobby Fish, O'Reilly, 
and Adam Cole all win their matches. They're hey, all man. champions. Yo, just picture it now. They've tried to take that picture before. Just picture it now. Undisputed era in the middle of the ring with all the championship gold around them. And who comes out? Champa. Oh. And that's your next view. Oh. Telling you right yo, now. Yo, where your pants, yo? Mm. About to I come don't know. Right in your anus. No. All that blood is leaving your fucking broken <laughs> leg and going somewhere else. Gone. Jesus. So that's who you got. You guys got Adam Cole for Adam real, for Cole, real. Bro. Yeah. I'm just. I'm happy. I'm gonna see a, a, what do you, a what match you to go up against for the, match. for the third step. For the third ladder, oh. ladder, 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 or something that benefits uh, undisputed era. I think it's Cage. Think it's a cage? I think it's cage. Nah, I think it's that's gonna be too hard to obvious. Play off yeah. The, oh, the, true, the, true, 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 true. Unless, yeah. I mean, if the whole, I hope, I hope the whole pay per view, right? It starts with a cage hanging over the ring, but they don't explain it all night. And then as the night goes to the end, right? And it's the third stipulation, it's a ladder match. What the you. fuck, bro? <laughs> put it there to fuck with you. Guys, you know what I would love even more? If it was a hell in the cell. Ooh. Ooh. The first Hell in the Cell match for NXT. In NXT. Yes. Uh, well, nah, to get to Fox, nah. we got to get through Sunday. But Sunday. 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 What's, What's going, going on on Sunday? Sunday? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we got church. Is yeah. It's a good thing we got this overlay because Rockefeller Sports Bar and Grill. Sunday, August 11th. You're going to hang with the bad guys. Come chill with us. We got a lot to do, a lot to see. We got games to play. We got SummerSlam to watch. The event of the summer come watch it with us why let's not right? let's let's go over this card real quick let's go yeah, over let's, this, let's card. Run through this shit real quick goldberg and dolph ziggler <laughs> that's gonna be the <laughs> the running tab so as, as we as the car be you know going through we'll be doing drinking all that shit so yeah all uh, that shit. just know that Here, I, I don't have the so, thing but i gotta go to <laughs> <laughs> i don't know where the tap is goldberg shits through dolph ziggler in two seconds what do y'all think? Uh, yeah. Yeah? I think it's unanimous. Although... So, wait, this opens up the night? Yeah. Nah, uh, I don't know. I, this probably ain't the order. Because I got the, all the title matches coming up later. Thank you. This is what matters. Here we go. Oh. Hey. Ricochet. Every time you're going to ruin time. my fucking pop? So, Ricochet <laughs> is going against AJ Styles for the United <laughs> States Championship, right? Uh, but not in the beginning of the show. It could gonna, open. It could open the show. It could open. It something. could be on the pre-show. <laughs> it could open the show. Wow. It's gonna open something. <laughs> this is what we've regulated nah, that match for. Ricochet and AJ Styles is gonna be on the card. That's gonna be a good fucking match. Okay. Yeah. So, but it, is it good enough that it'll open the show? Nah. I think so. Nah. I think uh, show Gold openers could be great. I think Goldberg and Dolph should do the pre-show. Damn. Nah. No way they do the pre-show. No, they won't. But, I, I, you know. Damn. All right, pre-show. We don't know the pre-show here, Listen, right? Cruiserweight championship. Fuck. Only Lorkin and Drew Gulak. Yep. Which is interesting Which will match. be a banger. I will give it's you that. a stiff yeah. match for sure. Yeah. Sure. A stiff one. Uh, Before or after the match? Hey. I have come <laughs> here to chew <laughs> bubblegum and kick ass. Well, that's good. Um, And Drew Gulak, I think, takes that. Yeah. I think he retains. Even though Only Lorkin... Is slowly building up, right, in uh, in the cruiserweight division and on Twitter. Orny Lork Lorkin, uh, fucking Lorkin, Lorkin is <laughs> that whiskey. Great stuff. Um, is a fun follow. If you don't follow him on Twitter, you should immediately. So we got Drew, right? Drew, I think Drew, right? Yeah. All right. Bray Wyatt, Finn Balor. Come on, Bray Wyatt, and another squash. Bray Wyatt. Bray Wyatt has to win. Yeah, in no fact, one. in <laughs> fact, okay. this match should not start. No, no. I think we're no, 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 no. This match should not commence. Oh, the match should not. Yes, he should just decimate. Yes, Finn comes out, and in the middle of his entrance, the lights go out. He gets fucked up. He's left fucking flat in the middle of the ring. Nothing can be done. It's over. That's save time too. That's who the fiend is. Because if you have a match, right, Finn can lose and look bad. Yeah. If Finn gets blindsided by a madman, there's there's future there. And the rumor is that Finn is going to miss he's some take, time. He's taking yeah. some time off, so it's, it's a good way to put him out. Great way to write him off. Yeah. Mm. Interesting. Trish Stratus versus Charlotte. Charlotte's taking this. You're not going to convince me Trish wins. 
No, no. This is Charlotte's. Re- I mean, um, Trish- Friday's retirement. Yeah, Trisha's retirement match. Is it? Is it? Yeah. She well, said this is her last. She'll go out on her back. Wow. Respectfully. <laughs> Shane McMahon versus <laughs> Kevin Owens. <laughs> TNA, baby. Shane uh, McMahon. Shane or has Kevin? to lose, right? Yeah, he has to lose. Yeah. yeah. Shane has Does to lose. I mean, I mean Stephanie could always rehire Kevin. Yeah, I was yeah. like, we've seen Steve Austin get fired numerous times. Many a time. So then tell me the story, because I don't see it. I don't I'm not I don't trust well, WWE. Well, dirty to finish. Tell us. No, Obviously. I don't I I just it would be straight you up. Could, you could do it old school. You could you could have KO lose, and then all of a sudden a generic wrestler shows up in a mask. Uh, El, El Generico. Generico. That'd be I really funny. Right, you <laughs> <laughs> That's all I'm saying. Shout out to War Horse. <laughs> I fucking love that drop. Um, Shout out to Tabby Brooks. Hey. The women's SmackDown women's title on the line, guys. Bailey first Ember Moon. Yeah, there's nothing convincing me that Ember Moon's gonna win. They've been shitting on her on television for the past two weeks. But that's why Sasha maybe. Banks is coming back. But what if Sasha comes back and screws back uh, Bailey? She wins by DQ and she keeps the belt. Or what? What if uh, Ember wins and and then Bailey is distraught and Sasha comes back and now they go after the tag title? It's the wrong again. month for that. Listen, oh Ember Moon God. is not gonna win. <laughs> Bailey is gonna win this. Good match. storytelling. <laughs> we have to wait till February for Ember Moon. <laughs> Good story. Oh, oh my wow. God. <laughs> Good storytelling <laughs> is that Sasha Banks interrupts the match in a way that Bailey loses the title and then it's Bailey Sasha program <laughs> and then Ember Moon goes in another direction. But God damn it, if I don't agree with you that that's what's probably going to happen. <laughs> Fuck. Becky Lynch, the man, versus Natalia in a submission match. I like that it's a submission match. Tap it out, tap it out, tap it and out. And Natalia's got to be as aggressive as she's been. She's been really good. Like, I don't say that. I don't say that. I fucking. It's not on the mic. Not on the mic, but don't give her a mic. Yeah, yeah. Let her be aggressive. Let let her go take fucking Becky down and put her in the sharpshooter, and that be. But, but you know, you notice why it hasn't cleverly. been terrible, son. Do yeah, it. It hasn't been terrible because even when she's on the mic, they're focusing her just talking about what you're gonna do to her. Yeah. And they're like, yo, just see all the fucking technical moves you know how to do. <laughs> and that's pretty. Much <laughs> so yeah, read was, the list. Where she was with Kayla in the back, armbar. Like, oh, I'm gonna challenge her to a submission match. This is what yeah. I do, and I learned it because of, you know what I mean. But I'm not gonna fine. do it, and she doesn't because I know she's not gonna want it. Exactly, but right. that's fine. Yeah, that that was kind of like that was the that's where you like what? they took a step back much. and they took away the mic, right? <laughs> but that's why because she's just on an aggressive tantrum. Uh, t- uh, tangent. Guys, can we, can we talk about the one match that when you talk about storytelling in February? Wow. <laughs> no, no, no. That's uh, eight months away. <laughs> well, speaking seven, of seven seven months. Right. Okay. <laughs> So. You were saying <laughs> something that wasn't going to get us banned. Exactly. From oh. every forum ever. <laughs> no nice things. No nice no things, nice things have, have happened. No nice things have happened. Exactly. That I forgot we had that. What that guy said. <laughs> what that guy I said. Karate, dickhead. That's not what he said. <laughs> yeah. And it's like, where no. Like, Talk to him, old school. But the, <laughs> the, the match... That should have happened about five years ago. <laughs> ten years ago. Is it ten years? Ten years, yeah. Well, that's what this is. Oh, nine. Oh, nine. 2009. Oh, nine. So, like, nine years I'm old ago. as hell, so, you know, sometimes time is He's relative. 36, then. Exactly. How can it How can The dementia kicks in, and that adds another 20 years. <laughs> Spit it out, Junior! Where are we going with this? That was a surprise I think drop. this is going to be the dement- best storyline we got, where we get Kofi going over Randy. Redemption? Mm. Yeah. yeah. You're so okay. stupid, match. Yeah. Well, listen. <laughs> for the WWE listen, after, after stupid, seeing, stupid, listen, stupid, stupid. After seeing Randy Orton get fucking RKO'd by his wife, I think uh, Kofi has a chance. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I think she's interfering. I think she's wow. interfering. For Kofi? <laughs> Not, I've seen videos yo, that end that way. It's listen, a, it's uh, a good feud. It's, a been, it's always been a good feud. <laughs> So Kofi, right? We all Kofi. feel Randy will take the L for everybody. Yeah, Kofi, Kofi. Kofi. Yeah. If and Kofi Kofi's loses, time. matter of fact, that's Randy's job now in life. And it's right, Kofi's time. Saying. But all right, so let's talk about Randy for a second. You think if he loses, like he loses his luster a little bit? Like he's been taking a lot of L's, dog. Take a break. He's the Viper. Like that's his role now. Like yeah. it's no one expects him to be world champion. Randy Beam, now. See, the problem yeah. is when you are the legend killer. Yeah. And now you become a legend. Sooner or later, you're gonna die. To, you know? 
it's kind of hard to be as relevant. Yo, well, shout out, shout out to Randy. put a great match. Shout out to Randy Orton for vacationing with his wife before SummerSlam, bro. Okay, yeah, RKO. Like no type of gym work at all. You got RKO. Yeah, talking about real. talking about her blood pumping and stuff while taking a picture. Did of oh, I'm ice? sure his blood is pumping. All right. Oh my. <laughs> shout Something out to shout out to yeah. Kim Morton. <laughs> you Did have sh- a magnificent ass. Ay, Dios mío. Prove it. Did she break her ankle? Oh man, that's a drop. Listen, Brock Lesnar, the main event versus Seth. Freaking Rollins. Brock Lesnar, man. Who Rollins. you got? Brock Lesnar. Stop it. Enough. Yes, enough. stop. Please, enough. I hope Brock kills Seth. I don't care. Seth. I don't care. According to what I've read, Seth Rollins is going over. I hope Seth is the one driving the car if it's not The Rock. You know what, what I'm sad? I'm, I'm afraid that <laughs> if Seth wins, going. it's because Becky interferes. Oh, man. Right? I'm tired of this storyline. So, so what you're saying is they're going to move the... The Maria of Michael Bennett storyline to, to the main event on Pretty steroids. Pretty much. Oh my God. Pretty you can't even much. win a world title yeah. match without me, pussy. Yeah. One thing's for sure the car's going to be interesting to say the least. Please check it out with us. Don't spend that money. Don't, you know, bother with the network at home by yourself. Right. You Come really want to pay us, $10 a Come month? Show with the bad guys. Ten dollars is at least two beers, dog. Like, come out with us. You know how many hot dogs ten dollars gets me? Ten. Woo! Five. Oh shit. Tancaro. Tancaro. <laughs> <laughs> he's doing Steiner, man, folks. My bad, my bad. Those are Hoboken prices. <laughs> hey. oh, oh, he's doing oh, Steiner, man, folks. Yo, <laughs> prende esa vaina. Prendelo, prendelo. I think it's time. Hey, JP we knew what we were talking about. Hey, I'm hey. surprised. So. So, a couple things, couple quickies real quick. Calavera. Ooh. Calavera comedy. Ese cara de verga. He said, what are our unpopular opinions? Hey, yo. What unpopular opinions do we got? I think. You want to hear an unpopular opinion? G1 Climax is overrated. Oh! Oh, shit. He said it. He said it. Was that why? Damn. Nah, I'm lying. Yo, that shit is really good. <laughs> so the wrestling is on point. Yo, it's just a lot to keep track of. It, they make it really hard to Listen, be a wrestling fan. We have the attention span of a mongoose, bro. When you give us that much fun. I used to have that bike when I was a kid, too. <laughs> mongoose? Oh, the mongoose races. Remember that? shit that got shit? robbed. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, you got robbed. Unpopular <laughs> opinions? Um... Yeah, Pokemon cards. Hey. Uh, can I elaborate a little bit? I don't Ali. think I don't think Roman <laughs> Reigns is that good of a wrestler. Yeah. I really don't. I think he's got a couple of really good moves. I think um, acting wise, he's going there, and I think he's getting better as a wrestler. But I don't think he's a great of a wrestler. I think WWE did a good job of shilling to the younger fans what he can be as a superhero. Who? Roman Reigns. Roman Reigns. To that point, another unpopular opinion. Becky Lynch is kind of fading. Mm. Becky Lynch is not who she was. And um, although Natalia has done, and it's really not her fault. I think that heels haven't, haven't healed enough. You know what I mean? Like Lacey Evans, after Lacey Evans, that there felt like a gap and, and Natalia's not there, right? Lacey Evans was good for what she was as a heel. And um, we need more fiery heels, I think, in general. Um, I'm glad that there's no Baron Corbin. Right, wow, Baron that's wow. not a sighting. Yeah. Did you, did you did you remember that Baron Corbin hasn't been on TV? No, Baron Corbin oh. or Lacey Evans. It has been exactly. Or Bobby Lashley. It has been Bobby Lashley no, got he's, hurt. Yeah, he's, yeah, he's, 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 doing, he's having surgery. Had surgery already. Oh, yeah. that's Fuck him. Um, uh, another unpopular opinion? Bobby Lashley's pretty damn fucking good. He's Bobby been La- as of late, yes. No, as of every time. He's a really good wrestler. He just isn't great at the storytelling part. No. And so don't let him to cut a promo. Let him fucking just go. He's the almighty. He's the destroyer. So yeah. that's what, what they did for Braun. Just run in just and beat it. the shit right. out of him. Do that shit for I think him. we need Lashley versus Brock at Mania. Oh. Uh, I don't know. Did you know Maybe. at one point Creed you can't have used two to call guys. Bobby Lashley Black Lesnar? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah I remember that. Yeah. I don't think you can you can put two guys that can't speak together on a match. Um, That's what Heyman's for. <laughs> Every time they get together. Uh, so, look, you want a, you want a different style yeah, build? Yeah, but you got Heyman versus Leo Rush on the mic? That might be a little different, but Little Rush is not. <laughs> <laughs> little, little Rush. That's what you call him. Little Rush. Little Rush. <laughs> Legion yeah. of Doom. Excellent. Little. Excellent hot shot. Five, nine, 954 on IG hit us up. 
responding to the Goldberg Ziggler. He had a prediction here. He predicts Goldberg will defeat Ziggler in two seconds. Dos segundos. I think we can all predict that. I think, right? That'd Doesn't it lot. take three seconds to win a match, though? Not these days. It's 2019. These spent attention spans. I don't. I don't think we're gonna get that off. I think that's perfect timing. What about y'all? Welcome. Uh, I'm just really hoping on the speed of error comes and helps him win. <laughs> <laughs> I just hope dope. he doesn't catch a concussion. That would be dope. Uh, uh, DJ Invert on Instagram, shout him out. Uh, he responded to our video with Trish slapping Charlotte, but he says they don't have tongues. That, wow. that says, what the fuck are you so saying? Good, sir, that says tongues, you dumb fuck. Tongues, yeah. Tongues. But, but what does he mean? Lengua, pendejo. Has, what is D-E-Y, by the way? Yeah. Day. Day. You it's know, like, it's like, like day. the opposite of night. <laughs> Apparently that day. man does but not have e. spell check on his phone, <laughs> first of all. <laughs> no, nah, but this motherfucker don't have spell check when he read. <laughs> he's there, he's there, I don't have it? that read check. What is yet? a thongus? The read check hasn't come in yet. It's in the mail. The but, fact uh, of the matter is that you guys don't want the smoke. You don't want to hear it from us. There's not time for that, that shit. There's no time to be reading. Smoke. There's no time for me fucking Read not to smoke anymore. That's all the time we have for you folks this no, week. Oh, come on. We know you got your site. You, you, we know you got your fix this week. What'd you get? Live. Live and oh, in we person. Got, we got a site. Fuck oh. via satellite. Well, yeah. He was pop I have multiple what? sites. Uh, this Sunday. This Sunday. Whenever Sunday. you're listening to this. August 11th. After church. 11. Is the biggest event of the summer. I mean, biggest. listen. If you follow wrestling at any capacity, at any level, there's only one thing to watch. And there's a lot of things to do, but there's only one thing to watch, and that one thing. Jeopardy. On Sunday. Sunday, oh, Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. Sunday. August 11th, 6 p.m., SummerSlam. But you're going to watch it with us. El trato All right? mira. And you know what? If you can't make it, we're going to put some stuff up for you to see and follow along with us. So come join us for the ride. It's going to be a lot of drinks, a lot of party, a lot of... Ooh. A lot of I, I heard we. I heard we Pandemonium. I heard we raffling We got off. games, prizes. We raffling off JP, right? Trivia. One, one night with JP. Hey. Uh, one night he in may China? or may not have his pants. Hey. Hey. One night in China? I hope Cards you like open. Arizona Ice hey. Tea. Hey. That means it was a good show. I hope <laughs> you guys like Arizona Ice Tea. Hey. 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 Dollar so bottle. Come, come watch with us, 6 p.m. Vodka. <sighs> Whiskey. A whole lot yeah. of that and a whole lot more. Subscribe. To our YouTube and all channels and platforms. Pretty sure. What do on iTunes? And don't forget to rate and do review. What? Do what? Scroll down. Do what? Rate and review. Do Give what? Us those five stars. What are you doing? Five stars. Just like I gave your mom five hickeys last night. Wow. Oh. Bichotazo. Five stars. Ten counts of ten. So 